All right, so I got a bunch of random pickups that I picked up through the week. I've been sick all week. It's been kind of a crazy week, but I uh, got a bunch of stuff here. I wanted to show you guys what we got, and let's go ahead and jump in the video. What is going on guys, Hess here, collectivekicks.com. If you guys want to shop this week's top sneaker deals, check the link in the description and happy shopping. So as I mentioned, there's a lot of random pickups in this video. We got two, three, four, five, six, six packages, something like that. So let's go ahead and start off with uh, the top one over here. All right, so the first package that I got here is from uh, the folks over at Rope Lace Supply. Holy crap. Look at all these laces, man. Uh, so this is crazy. They sent so many pairs of laces. So these ones right here are all Yeezy laces. Love the, the theme and the colors of these. They definitely go with the release sneakers. Uh, so these ones are the perfect size for Yeezy 350s. But they also have Jordan 1 replacement laces and these things are the perfect size and it's basically like a retail pair of the Jordan 1 laces. So definitely worth checking them out. I know it's a rope lace supply, but these are the flat laces for uh, Jordan 1s. They also have some nice quality leather laces as well, which is something that I've really liked in the past. For those that follow me on Instagram and Twitter, I posted these a couple times as well as the Royal colorway that I have in the backdrop. Uh, and I love the, the leather laces on these ones. They just look crazy and uh, they just fit perfectly and look really dope. So the leather laces are definitely a nice look as well. They got a bunch of like Marikami inspired laces also, which is pretty cool. Uh, obviously I'm a fan of the Marikami artwork stuff. I have tons of different complex con t-shirts uh, from all of the different complex cons for the last handful of years. So those are cool as well. Some tie dye laces and some other themes as well. As you can see here, some Bape and some CDG and some leopard print even. And then here's some more laces that they sent also. So these are just standard type laces or just different designs. And this one's even like woven. Rope Lace Supply has a lot of cool stuff for sure though. Tons and tons of different options if you haven't seen them uh, in the past. So definitely worth checking them out if you haven't. It's a great gift for other people as well. Definitely something that is fun to be able to just lace swap. It gives different looks to sneakers. And as an example, I did like a Reese's lace swap on my uh, One Lows here with the Travis Scott. Uh, with orange laces and actually I changed them up with uh, the pink laces and I put those ones on the Timberlakes and it kind of reminds me of a pair of Yeezys this one does and then these ones look kind of like that but uh, just giving you some examples of things that you can do with some of the laces from Rope Lace Supply like they have a ton of different laces out here so like sky's the limit for your imagination of what you can accomplish with some of these lace swaps. In fact, if you guys see any laces in the video that you guys really like, leave a comment of what laces in this video and also leave a hashtag rope lace supply, one word, and I'll pick some winners and just gift uh, a bunch of these laces out to you guys. Just a crazy, crazy amount of laces though. Thank you to Rope Lace Supply for sending these over. And if you guys, again, haven't checked out their site, you guys gotta go check it out. Definitely worth doing it. It's definitely one of those sites that should be on your radar at all times. All right, so another thing that I ended up picking up uh, from David got kicks. Shout out to him for sending them over my way. But I posted on an Instagram story that I got um, some AirPods. It was the first time I got them actually. And he said that he had these cases uh, from his shop that I will link in the description. And uh, basically, it's just like a an EarPod case that looks like an Air Jordan. He had a Marikami one that actually I'm still using right now for my AirPod cases because it looks so dope. And then also uh, this off-white uh, one right here. So kind of a, a fun one. I'm gonna give away these ones on like Instagram or something like that. So follow me on Instagram if you don't, at Heskicks, and I'll be giving away both of these. So that was another thing that was sent over, kind of cool. And I know there's a lot of stuff out here, but I'm saving the best for last, this big, huge box, which is kind of crazy. Uh, but we got another small package here. This is one from uh, Instagram as well, I think. This is somebody that reached out to me on Instagram, left me a DM, and I actually was checking my DMs for the first time ever, and, um, and I saw his post, and I was like, oh, dude, like, send me your information, and I'll buy one of your shirts, and... He, um, he wouldn't let me t like give him money. So let's see what he ended up sending here. So it's a Live Like Dante shirt. And I'm gonna put this here if you guys wanna read this part right here, you can. And then if you guys wanna read this part right here, you can. Continue this on right here so you can read this if you're interested in reading um, their letter. Uh, Cause I'm not gonna read it on camera, I'll read it off camera. There's a lot of information here. And the person that reached out is David, his father. And I appreciate what the dude's doing. He's doing some stuff for his kid. His kid has Down syndrome. And so he has a Down syndrome awareness uh, campaign that he's kind of running here with uh, Dante. And I, I really like the message behind it. And like, 
He ended up sending a, uh, a shirt over, so let's take a look here. It says, I feel like Dante on it right here. It says, and the R word for Down Syndrome Awareness. Live like Dante and it's his signature right there. Uh, so yeah, man, I definitely think this is a good message. And anyway, if you guys want to check the link in the description, I will link you over to his Instagram and you guys can support the cause over there uh, for Dante and for uh, Daniel. So thank you for sending that over my way. And I love the message you're sending. Uh, again, support behind your kid and just fully embracing uh, your guys' in individual situations out there. Uh, and, and I'm glad I, I checked the, the Instagram DM because it's something, again, that I don't usually do. If you guys do need to contact me for business reasons or whatever else, uh, the best way to contact me is through my email, which I put in every video. So check, scroll down in the description, find my email address, and then you can send some stuff over my way. All right, so moving on, got a couple other things over here that I wanted to share with you guys. Super quick, Kith Monday program. I actually hit on something for the first time in forever. Let's see, take a look. So it is salmon colored, like from the site it said salmon, but the images looked orange. I was actually hoping for orange, but this is crazy. Look at the embroidery on this is super, super thick. So there's a giant koi fish on the back and then it does say Nobu and Kith down at the bottom for the back. That's a really nice print on the back of this hoodie. Super mega heavy hoodie uh, from Kith right here. Hibbit Sports sent over a couple pairs of sneaks my way. Two pairs of sneakers from Hibbit Sports. Uh, shout out to the folks over at Hibbit. I have a video coming up where I will showcase both of these in more detail, but uh, there is one right here. Ooh, look at that. Uh, this is Nick's colorway of Air Jordan uh, threes. And man, I wish there was a way that I can transform these. I really wanted to see if I can transform these into black instead of the blue, but with the blue on the sole, it's kind of a dagger because you can't really change the, the colors on soles too easily. It just doesn't work very well. But sick colorway nonetheless. I mean, honestly, if it didn't have the blue, I would be all about this colorway. Definitely one that people are sleeping on. Quality feels actually pretty good uh, on this shoe. And um, I'm a huge fan of the Air Jordan 3. And uh, any of those NYX occasions, these are the ones to step out in. But NYX 3s. And then another LeBron 17. This one, though. Ooh. Look at this LeBron 17, man. Like, so I'll have a video featuring these in detail. Uh, in fact, I'll show you a little clip of it right here. Look for the video in the next couple days. But man, I love the look of this LeBron 17. We definitely have like the East and West Coast vibes going on right here. The Laker vibes on this one is really strong. And the insoles on these ones with that Lakers font is just super crazy. Looks like they do have something different on these Knicks joints right here, but it wasn't something that was really talked about. So, but anyway, so those are the Knicks and the Laker joints right here. If you could only choose one pair though, which one would you choose? Would you go Knicks? Would you go Lakers? Leave a comment, let me know. Uh, I think that both of these are dope. And then the biggest thing is in this box right behind me. So I gotta get this box out right over here. Yo, look at this thing. So I actually hit on this Cause Gone uh, figurine and this is crazy big. I thought it was like a small one. I didn't realize it was this big. Um, and the retail on this was over $600. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we got. Oh boy, holy shiitakes. This is a crazy work of art. So this is super heavy. It's not lightweight at all. Um, I got this from the first drop. They did have a restock, I think last week on these, but, uh, but I actually hit on this one the first week. Now, of course I was trying to go for the pink version and I struck out on that one. Funny thing is I actually had a pink version of one of the cause drops previously and I sold it, I think, for $400 or something like that, or $430. And now that exact one is selling for $1,500. But this one is cool, man. I like the vinyl. It looked crazy. I mean, I've always kind of been a fan of the Cause vinyls. It's just been super expensive. So uh, not something I could justify for keeping in my collection, really. But, um, but man, this is $600. So we'll see what happens with this one. 
I'm not sure if prices are going to go up on these. Like they were selling for over a thousand, then they dropped quite a bit. Uh, but then, you know, in another year, like it might jump back up. But, uh, but what do you guys think, man? Like, is this something that you guys would have caught for $600? I think it was six twenty dollars after shipping. Super big and heavy, but it's kind of, to be honest, it's a little bit wobbly. I don't know if it's just because the booties are on, but it's a little wobbly. Super crazy though, and that's the last thing I got from the video. Anyways, thanks for stopping by and watching. If you guys want to see the Lakers video that I have of these coming up, uh, I will be posting that. Do you guys want a dedicated video to these also? Uh, it seems like a pair that a lot of people are sleeping on. Maybe something that I could do a video on, kind of a cool uh, colorway. And I'm going to try to figure out what the mystery is of this. Obviously, that's the date inside of here, so it's definitely worth um, taking a flashback and seeing what this is representing. And somebody can leave a comment, let me know if they do know, but uh, maybe I'll do a detailed video on these as well. But that's uh, that's what we got. Thanks for stopping by and watching. If you guys like this style of video, uh, leave a like on the video. If you'd prefer to see me in the video, I can do that, but honestly, it's just more distracting. It's easier for me to just sit back and open with you guys. But, um, but yeah, thanks again for watching. Have a good rest of the day. Anybody else that's sick out there like I am, man, hopefully you guys get over this cold. It's been terrible. Like literally terrible. I've left the house alone like for 10 minutes the entire week. It's been terrible. But uh, yeah, have a good rest of the weekend. We will see you guys for some more videos very soon. Peace, guys.